Awareness and support. That's the goal behind a new nonprofit organization in Placer County. Your reporter covering Placer County, Brady Hop Live, is live with how the new foundation aims to help victims and survivors of crime. Brady? Yeah, that's right, guys. Many of these victims um, experience grief and trauma on a daily basis. So basically, what this foundation is doing is streamlining a lot of these services to help these people cope. I was not at all prepared. Nothing prepares a mother to lose a daughter. You know, my daughter was went missing. It turned out it was, you know, she was kidnapped, murdered, her body hidden for 15 years. In 2005, Christy Wilson was last seen leaving the Thunder Valley Casino with Mario Garcia. He would later be convicted and sentenced to prison. But it was more than just losing her daughter. Boyd experienced the trauma of a long investigation, countless court hearings, and a trial. Here I was with a daughter that was missing, you know, a no body homicide case. And what we went through just in terms of trying to get support was unreal. Boyd says there's a significant gap in funding for victim and survivor services. And that's where the Placer Justice Foundation comes in. They offer grief counseling, which is lacking in many counties statewide. Guidance in navigating court proceedings, which can often be complex and intimidating. Financial aid to families traveling to Placer County for court hearings and financial aid for wages loss for time taken off work. Oftentimes there is support that is needed and so you know for the grief counseling that's a tremendous need. Forensic neuropsychologist Dr. Judy Ho says victims of grief and trauma can develop symptoms that are debilitating and often require support. Sometimes they're more likely to mistrust other people. Other times they may feel like they can't connect with people the same way. Dr. Ho says it's organizations like the Placer Justice Foundation that can provide people resources and services to help ease some of these symptoms. So having an organization like this as a support system is so crucial so that they know that they're not going through it by themselves. A way to find meaning through grief to help others. Victims need more than bottled water and mints when they're going through this process. And, you know, to have, have a group of folks that really understand it and can be there. Now, Bo Boyd hopes this foundation will lay the blueprint for other counties to implement something similar in their counties, guys.